I first became involved with MDA when my wonderful mother was diagnosed with ALS. And as a mom myself, I know how important it is to you and how you always want to be there for your children, offering support and help no matter how tired you are or what challenges life has thrown your way. My mother certainly wanted that, and so does Veronica Nino. For Veronica, along with her husband and children, life was forever changed last year when she received a diagnosis of ALS. But her determination to be a great mom and leader in her community is bolstered by the help of her family and the strength they receive from MDA. There you go. My name is Veronica. I was officially diagnosed in March of 2011, and I have ALS. I am a mom. I have three wonderful children on most days. I do work. I have a full-time job. I am an assistant principal in the Houston metro area. My lifestyle, kind of like a friendly, chaotic lifestyle, just keeps me on my toes. My number one purpose is just to be the best person I can be, the best wife I can be for my husband, the best mom I can be for my kids. She's a total hero to me. She gives me all of her love. As a mom, I had to be very careful how I communicated what was going on to me with my children. They see it, mom's getting weaker, and we're gonna need to help her with a lot of stuff. This time last year, she was still walking, and now she's in a power chair. The biggest challenge of having ALS is the uncertainty. Everything changes with Veronica every day. Any neuromuscular disease puts your life in a tailspin and it changes everything. And it's very, very time consuming. The great thing about the MDA clinic is that it gives me the opportunity to come on one day and have everybody that needs to see me, see me. And it makes it very convenient. That's great. If my family and I did not have access to the MDA clinic, I think things would be very daunting. It would probably feel like we were alone. Last night I had a crazy dream. Yeah. 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 Wish was granted yeah. just yeah. for me. I think it's critically important for people to support MDA. Someone you know is affected and someone you know needs your help. One more day with you. One more day. One more time. One more chance. I want another day with my kids. I want another day with my family. I want to be around. I pray that someday some doctors will find this cure and just give it to my mom. Oh, come on, be God. Oh, God. Yes. One more day. Only two. One little honeybee. With you. And without MDA, I would not have my wife right now. MDA is uh, his family. Because they help. Veronica, I gotta say, I so know what you and your family are going through after receiving a diagnosis of ALS, as my mom was diagnosed with. And I want to know what you're thinking, sitting here watching your story right there and everything MDA has done for you. What I'm thinking is that I'm so lucky to have a wonderful family, wonderful friends and support. My family at MDA is fabulous. And without them, I would truly have a hard time. I want to make an appeal to everyone watching this weekend as you enjoy your families and your children Please stop and make a generous donation to support MDA and their work. Someone out there needs your help. Thank you. Well, please call 1-800-FIGHT-MD and you can go to mda.org to charge your secure donation. You can also make a $10 donation by texting MDA to the number 20222. And we thank you very much, don't we, Veronica? Yes, we do. Thank you.